The stars of 1000 Love Sisters have been busy since the newest installment, Season 5, aired, and it's time to talk about what they've been up to. Tammy Slayton, Amy Slayton Halterman, Amanda Halterman, Chris Combs, Misty Slayton, Brittany Combs, and Michael Halterman all appeared in the newest installment. And so did Amy and Michael's kids, Glenn and Gage Halterman. On screen, there was so much drama. Tammy was making real progress in her weight loss journey when she lost her ex-husband, Caleb Willingham. The stars of 1000 Love Sisters have been busy since the newest installment, season 5, aired, and it's time to talk about what they've been up to. Tammy Slayton, Amy Slayton Halterman, Amanda Halterman, Chris Combs, Misty Slayton, Brittany Combs, and Michael Halterman all appeared in the newest installment. And so did Amy and Michael's kids, Glenn and Gage Halterman. On screen, there was so much drama. Tammy was making real progress in her weight loss journey when she lost her ex-husband, Caleb Willingham. During the newest installment, Tammy was slimming down. Meanwhile, Amy was facing some hard truths about her marriage. Michael wasn't the right man for her. Michael's a control freak who refused to give his wife access to her own bank card. He wasn't much help with the kids either. Amy ended her marriage even though she had two kids under two years old. During 1000 of Sisters season five, she was not doing well. Amy cried a lot. It was wrenching to see her suffer. Now it's time to share information about what happened to the show's stars after the installment. Tammy's a great dancer, even though she basically apologized for her moves in the cute TikTok video shown above. Haters give Tammy a hard time about almost everything, but having a good time's the best revenge. In this clip, Tammy looks truly happy. She's dancing and enjoying it, She's proud enough to put her dance video out there for the whole world to see. She knew some people would throw shade and didn't care. She's in a better place emotionally after 1000 of Sisters season five. Tammy may not really love herself yet after years of depression, but she's getting there. She had to deal with so much heart hatch when she lost Caleb, as seen in the clip above. Although they weren't a couple when he passed away, she loved him. Part of the issue between them was the fact that Caleb couldn't get a handle on his emotional eating. He kept sneaking food in diet rehab. Actually, he was more blatant than that. He kept baskets of junk food in plain view. Tammy nearly died because she was so heavy. She needed a partner who was also committed to a healthy lifestyle. Now Tammy's dating a woman called Amanda spending plenty of time with her BFF Haley Michelle, and performing online. Tammy won't forget Caleb, but she's moving forward. Once Tammy weighed 725 pounds, now she's comparatively sleek at 278 pounds. Her epic weight loss has changed her, bringing out Tammy's inner child. She's trying new things, from going on her first plane ride to hanging out on a boat to lazing at the beach. Whether Tammy's pretty in pink or a lady in red, she's showing off superstar style. Amy wasn't enjoying life at all in 1000 of Sisters season five. Her attitude was very negative. She had crying jacks and Amy didn't seem to be able to handle the demands of parenting. Being a mom to a baby and toddler is hard work that's basically 24 sevenths. Most parents in that situation grab some sleep when they can or get a babysitter so they can unwind. Amy tried to find outlets, but her husband stood in her way. She had a husband who should have been helping her. Something else was happening to her. Well, it had already happened. During the season, Amy, who now weighs 230 pounds due in large part to a successful bariatric procedure, which she had in 2019, was living with mental illness. Her problems were quite serious, and while the show was being filmed, she didn't know what was wrong. After the season, she got help from a doctor who diagnosed her with depression, acute anxiety disorder, and bipolar disorder. Amy seems to be in a better place now.
Just days ago, in early May 2024, she posted on Instagram, showing off a brand new mother's ring. She did order it for herself, but considers it to be from her boys, Glenn and Gage. Motherhood was always Amy's dream. While her untreated mental illnesses were making it hard for her to appreciate all the special moments with her kids, Amy was brave enough to get help. She seems more balanced now, perhaps due to medication and slash or therapy. While she'll always have hard days as a single parent, Amy probably smiles a lot more now. As for her love life, Amy hasn't had the best luck. After her marriage failed, she tried to move on with a man named Kevin. For a while, she seemed elated. Kevin appeared to care about Amy and her kids. However, he may have been a charmer who was faking his love. Amy began posting disturbing TikTok messages about emotions, cryptically sharing the fact that she was hurting due to her dynamic with another person. Then she got more overt, adding a TikTok featuring Amy in a black dress. She added the comment, Men can be disappointing, and maybe Amy tried to move on too quickly after divorce. She wasn't wrong to try, but it didn't work out. She felt that Kevin was with her for clout. Hopefully, the next person she dates will be a nicer person. Kevin hasn't shared his side of the story, so his take on their relationship remains a mystery. At least Amy didn't marry Kevin, as another divorce might be devastating. She's probably still healing after her split with Michael. After bariatric surgery, Slayton half-sister Amanda Halterman lost over 300 pounds. Amanda, who's usually a cheery, sensible presence on the popular series, was a bit too hard on Amy during the season. So was Chris. However, she obviously cared about her. Now that Amanda's improving her health by slimming down, she's proud to flaunt the results. Amanda was so pretty in pink in the Instagram post shown above. She glowed while attending her son's graduation ceremony, writing in her caption, Amanda wore an unusual pink sweater with metallic details, and the color was perfect for her. Her skin was radiant, and her body was obviously much slimmer. Like other Slayton family members, Amanda's really blooming after weight loss. Her face is much thinner, and she appears to be feeling a lot better. Amanda was able to stop taking diabetes medication due to her weight loss. Now she's branching out as an entrepreneur. Amanda launched her own merchandise line and fans can learn more by checking out Amanda's Instagram post about the Amanda Halterman collection. She sells her designs via the Dayson Co. Boutique in downtown Kentucky. Amanda's link to the collection didn't work and she was asked to repost it. She hasn't done so yet, but she probably will soon. She encouraged fans to visit and slash or follow Dace and Co. for updates. She's starting out small with a streamlined collection, but has big plans for her merch line. Chris used to overeat as Tammy, Amy, and Amanda did. Perhaps the future reality stars were never taught about nutrition. They grew up eating a lot of unhealthy foods. Chris has a different dad than Amy and Tammy. That's why his last name is Combs. His father is also Misty and Amanda's dad. Tammy and Amy came along later via the man that their mother, Darlene, got together with after splitting from Chris, Misty, and Amanda's father. The family tree isn't really complicated, but understanding it makes it easier to grasp the Slayton Halterman dynamic. Chris is an intelligent guy. He dresses well, usually gives good advice and seems to have his priorities in order. He's family oriented and his decision to lose weight was prompted by concerns about longevity. Chris' father passed away when he was only 57. Chris knew that his dad had been extremely overweight in the 400 to 500 pound range. He didn't want to put his own life at risk due to emotional eating, so he decided to get bariatric surgery. Chris looks shockingly skinny nowadays. Clearly, his surgical procedure was a big success. The change in his face and body is dramatic. In fact, he's almost unrecognizable. 
he poses with his truly adorable grandkids in the Instagram post shown above. Everyone's dressed up for Easter, and it's a very cute picture. Chris clearly treasures the little ones. They bring so much joy to his life. It's great that he took action to improve his health. Now, God willing, he can be around for his wife, kids, and grandchildren over the long term. Misty appeared in 1,000 Little Sisters Season 2 when she went along on a spooky Halloween hair ride. According to Tammy, Misty's the family's hanging judge, to paraphrase. Misty doesn't mince words, and if she doesn't like someone, such as one of Amy's boyfriends, she will make her opinion clear. She doesn't hide her emotions. Misty isn't a major presence on the show, but she still gets noticed, although a lot of viewers might not know much about her. She's a mom with four kids and devoted most of her adult life to looking after them. Then she decided to do something for herself, which was getting bariatric surgery. As one of the pics above shows, be sure to scroll through them all. Misty is a whole new woman. She's lost what looks like hundreds of pounds. Her face is extremely lean now, but the exact amount of weight she's lost is a mystery. In 2024, she's showcasing a thin body. The Slayton family is all about eye-popping body makeovers. Brittany really made the scene in 1000 Little Sisters Season 4, and a bonus scene revealed the real reason why she doesn't cut her very long tresses. Chris' wife Brittany explained that she eschews makeup and haircuts in order to stick with her religious beliefs. When people try to give her a makeover, she won't let them. She goes for an extremely natural look. It's kind of an old-fashioned vibe. Chris has posted a lot of Christian content on his Instagram. He and Brittany are true believers. Brittany continues to love her long locks in 2024. Chris posts some cute pics of his wife. He is very devoted to her. In Chris' Instagram post, as shown above, Brittany glows in a burnt orange dress and white headband. Her style may be a little too old school for some people, but she loves the way that she looks. It's great that she has high self-esteem despite some shade from her nearest and dearest, not Chris, of course, over her hair and bare face. Like her husband, she's lost a lot of weight, 269 pounds. Michael really needs a PR specialist after his villain edit in season 5. In 2024, he seems to be trying to do damage control on his own, posting photos of the kids and promoting his presence at Cameo. However, after watching his wife cry out of sheer exhaustion, while he sat around, it's unlikely that he'll become a powerful influencer. Yes, Amy may have been difficult at times, but Michael didn't meet her halfway. He put most of the childcare on her, wearing her out. He seems fine now, but he was no gentleman on 1,000 of sisters.